Are you ready for some Halloween magic? Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. This is Amy from You Try It. Today, I have this spooky and delicious recipe to share with you. Best of all, it's super easy to prepare. I always bring a treat to my friend's Halloween costume party, and this will be the perfect treat to share. So follow me to the dungeon. Oh, I mean kitchen. And I will show you how to make this jack-o'-lantern s'more sliders. First, you will need a package of King's Hawaiian's Original Hawaiian Sweet Rolls. I've got a 12 count package here, but feel free to double the recipe if you are feeding a crowd of little monsters and goblins. Take the Hawaiian Sweet Rolls out of the package and slice it in half lengthwise. Set the top half of the rolls aside for now. Place the bottom half in a baking pan. Spread half a cup of chocolate hazelnut spread on top into an even layer. Next, sprinkle one and a quarter cup of mini marshmallows over the chocolate spread. Make sure the marshmallows are in one single layer for even heat distribution. Place the baking pan six inches away from the broiler for about one minute. Make sure you don't walk away because the marshmallow can toast up really quickly. Rotate the baking pan halfway through. When the marshmallows are all golden brown and charred up, remove from the oven to cool down slightly. Meanwhile, place 3 gram crackers into a zip top bag. Roll them with a rolling pin until they are all crushed up. When it's cool enough to handle, transfer the bottom half of the sweet roll onto a serving platter. Sprinkle the graham cracker crumbs on top evenly. Then, place the top half of the reserved sweet roll on top. Now, on to the super fun part of the recipe, decorating these sliders. I'm using a tube of black cookie icing. And here's a tip for you. Make sure to only snip off a small portion of the tip so that you have more control of the flow of the icing. Draw the jack-o'-lantern's faces onto these buns. Be creative and try out different facial expressions too. My kids always enjoy helping me in decorating the treats. So be sure to invite your little ones to help out and have some fun in the kitchen. I also add on some sprinkles for cuteness. Cut out one and a half inches of breadstick to mimic the stems of the pumpkins. You can add some decorative toothpicks too, but that is totally optional. And now, your jack-o'-lantern small sliders are all dressed up and ready to go. These sliders taste exactly like the campfire s'mores, which are my kiddos' all-time favorite treats. Now, it's your turn to go get some King's Hawaiian sweet rolls and make these small sliders to share with your friends and family. Be sure to make extras because it will be really scary when they're all gone. <coughs> Thank you King's Hawaiian for sponsoring this video and thank you everyone for watching. And remember, eat, drink, and be spooky. Happy Halloween! Boo! Before you go, please remember to click on the subscribe button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much and I'll see you all next time.